Dress making lesson 5, drafting the basic pajama trousers. By it's so easy. Tools and materials needed. L square, hip curve, French curve, ruler, tape measure, pencil and pattern paper. Fold the pattern lengthwise and draw the construction line in folded area. Make sure you have 10 cm allowance on the top edge of the pattern. And then list down the measurements needed. Pants length, crotch divide by 4, hip 2 divide by 4 plus 2 cm, and the bottom divide by 2. A is the starting point. A to B is pants length. For my example, it is 86 cm. Mark this point B. From A, measure the crotch length. In my example, it is 24 cm. Mark C. C to D is one fourth of crotch. Measure it upward from C, in my example it is 6 cm, and then square out points D, C, and then point B. C to E is one fourth of hip two plus two centimeters. In my example, it is twenty five centimeters. Then mark this point E, and then A to F is same measure of C to E, so it is also twenty five centimeters. Then G one centimeter inward from F. Now connect G and E with the use of ruler and then mark the intersection as point H and then measure 5 cm from point E and mark it point I and then connect H and I with the use of French curve. B to J is one half bottom circumference Mark it point J and then connect I and J with a straight edge or with hip curve if you want the inseam a little bit tapered on the tie. But in my case, I will connect it with straight edge. This is now the front part of the pajama. Now, with the use of tracing paper and tracing wheel, we will transfer the pajama on the other side of the pattern. After this, I will show you how to make the back part of pajama in few steps. Just make sure that the tracing paper is under the part that you are tracing. This is the trace part of the pajama, and now open the pattern. I will mark the part that I have traced for you to see it clearly. Now we're ready in making the back part of pajama. This time, I will use red marker in making the back part. From G, measure 2 cm inward and mark it point 1. And then connect point E to point 1 with extension. From 1, measure 4 cm upward and mark it point 2. 
then connect point 2 to this point this point is the corner of waist and front crotch now from point I measure 3 cm outward and mark it point 3 then using French curve connect the back crotch on this line and the point 3 from J measure 2 cm outward and mark it point 4 and then connect 3 and 4 if you use hip curve in shaping the front then use it on the back and now we are done with the front and back of pajama trousers now let's have the allowance for the waist measure 4 cm Allowance for the waist will depend on the garter that you will use. This allowance is good for 1 inch width of garter. Two centimeters for the crotch. Make sure that corners are connected. Inseam allowance is also 2 cm. Make sure that corners are connected. Allowance for the bottom is 3 cm from that point. Now, let's get the pattern. Fold the hemline or bottom allowance before cutting the inseam. Now we're done. If you have comment and suggestion, just type in the comment section.